Hey there everyone, my name is JW, welcome back to the channel. Today I've got another awesome tank tutorial for you. But first, we're going to mention the Tank Hour Slash Discord server. If you want to receive a shout out at the start of a video, or request a build to be built, look no further than the Tanker Yard. There are two ways of joining. One, leave your gamer tag down below in the comment section of this video. Or two, join the Discord server and receive a special rank for joining the Tanker Yard. And what gamer tags am I looking for? Well, I'm looking for your Java, Bedrock, Xbox, PlayStation, or Nintendo gamer tag, and you'll be entered into the tank yard here. Receive a shout out. Speaking of shout outs, today we have a new person joining. Yay, new purple, new people, people, purple people. And today we are introducing Galen Skywalker. Welcome, Galen Skywalker, to the tank yard. I hope I got the correct player head. If not, uh, well, then the name was. Uh, typed in incorrectly and uh, yes but um welcome Galen Skywalker so welcome to the tank here buddy happy to have you and happy to have you among the ranks so let us continue so today let's see what we're building today well obviously you guys know what we're building today today we're building this the German prototype World War II E100 uh, the only thing that was ever built of it in real life was just the hull. Only the hull was built, but, um, we're putting the turret on today. Uh, this, I believe, is the Krupp turret. So, yeah, uh, let's get into it. So, down to Germany. Down to Deutschland. And let's go build ourselves an E100, shall we? There it is. Quite easy to spot. Alright, so E100 time. So let's get our material, shall we? Today we'll be needing Paul's Andersite, Stone Brick Slab, Stone Brick Stair, Stone, Stone Stair, Stone Slabs, Andersite Wall, Block of Coal, and Black Concrete. Alright, so once you find a spot to start, I am going to start right here with one. And then two, three, four, five, six. Skip three. And one, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. And then go outside. One, two, three, four, five, six. Again. One, two, three, four, five, six. Should have this pattern. Okie dokie. Now we add in the stone brick slabs. Which one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 16 on each side on the first layer. There we go. Next, we'll put some placeholders down. One, two, and three, four. Next, one, two, three, four, and on the front. There we go. All right, next. Stone brick stairs. One, two. One, two. On the back, we're going to switch to Paul Sandersite right here. And then put in the stairs that way. All right, next, we're going to put Paul Sandersite here. And then some stone. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And there we go. Next, some stone brick slabs to finish off the tracks. There we go. There's one side, and let's do the other side. And there we go. Track section is complete. Now remember, folks, if I'm going too fast for you, you can always pause, rewatch, rewind, and do whatever you need to do to get this awesome tank into your world. So let us continue. All right, so starting at the front here, we're going to do, oh, let's see, we're going to start right here, one, two, three, four, five, six, and we're going to put full blocks right here with an upside down stair, just like that, and then we're going to come out and completely cover up the front with slabs right here, okie dokie, now we can come inside and do the slabs on the inside. All the way down to about here. All right, and then we put in full blocks to completely surround the inside, block up any holes that might be there. All 
There we go. And we can do another row like that. And then we're going to put upside down stairs here and here. Followed by another row up and then out. There we go. Next to that, we're going to put some upside down stairs. And another two full blocks. And there we go. Now you can build this without the side skirts if you want to, but oh, we're going to add the side skirts now. Alright, so we're going to put in the space armor. So we're going to take slabs and bring them all the way back to about uh, right here. Sounds good. So you should have this on this side and this side. We're going to do the same thing. Bring slabs all the way down to right there. Alright, so next we're going to put one stair. One stair. Then full block. Full block. Three stairs. Three stairs. Two full blocks. Two full blocks. Three stairs. Three stairs. Two full blocks. Two full blocks. Two stairs. Two stairs. One full block. One full block. And then we're going to put a stair here and then twist it and bring it across. And twist at the end. There we go. And here we're going to finish up with some slabs. There we go. Another way to finish up is we're going to put another layer of full box on the inside here. Just like this. And there we go. Alright, we almost got the chassis done. So next we're going to put some exhaust vents here, exhaust pipes, and then we're going to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven slabs, bring it in, like, actually no, wait, only do five, and then bring them in like so, there we go, and then around like that, and then in like so, so, and here we're going to put blocks of coal. And right here, we can separate the engine compartment from the fighting compartment. There we go. Alright. Next to the front. Right in the center here, we're going to put a stair like so. And then slabs on both sides. Full block right behind it. Slabs, slabs, and then finish off with slabs going around. And you can come inside and break out those two blocks so you can actually get in down here. It's quite cozy, quite comfy. All right, so with that out of the way, now we can start putting in the turret. So this is the hull. This is about historically correct as far as it got right here. So if you want historically correct, you went harder. This is as far as you go. And now we put in the turret. So next we're gonna do one, two, three, four, five. And one, two, three, four, five. And they connect each side with stairs. Upside down stairs. There we go. And on this side as well. And there's that. Alright, next we're going to put stairs on each side right here. Followed by more full blocks in the center. And then right here, three, three slabs right there. All right, next we're gonna put three blocks here. Let's skip a space and put three more blocks and right here will be black concrete. Again, one, two, three, skip, one, two, three, and then black concrete. And on the back you just fill it up. There we go. All right, next we're gonna put in a stair right here and then twist it, bring it all the way to the end and twist. Twist all the way down and twist. There we go. We're going to put two stairs right here. Followed by a full box right here. Slab here. And slab here. And full blocks across. I'm going to put another set of stairs here. Full block. And there's that wall. And then here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No. Hang on. Oops, we forgot to add the, well, the gun mantlet. One, two, right there. And then we could go, let me restart this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And there we go. 
going to put full blocks behind here. I'm going to put slabs here and here. Right here, we're going to do one, two, one, two, and then slabs, just like so. And then we can do, let's see, how did I do this? We're going to put temporary full blocks right here. And then we're going to put slab coming off its sides, and then all along the top here. It'll give us our range finders. There we go. Next, we're going to put stairs in here. There we go. And then we'll just finish up with a row here. Bring it up through and a row here. And finish off with two slabs right here. All right. So we have the turret basically done and the whole body done. So we can get rid of all these materials and we're going to move on to cosmetic materials. All right, so for cosmetics, we're going to need iron trapdoor, dark oak trapdoor, light gray carpet, polished blackstone button, dark oak button, daylight detector, heavy weighted pressure plate, tripwire hook, and a birch button. Birch button to start off with is on the black concrete blocks. Tripwire trip wire hooks are going to go right here. Heavy weighted pressure plates here, and then up above right here and here daylight sensors right here dark oak buttons down below polished blackstone buttons on the sides and the rear on the sides again. Light gray carpet along the front. On the sides. On the rear and the other side. On the top. Dark oak trap doors. One, two. Three, four. Gonna put one here with an iron trap door. There we go. On the insides here. There we are. All right. Now, last is let's get some more materials real quick. Spruce sign, item frame, and glass pane. So your spruce signs, right here and here, and we're gonna put a gray carpet right there. All right, so spruce signs are done. Iron trap doors, one underneath there. On the corners here. On the hole. There we go. On the turret. And that should do it for the iron trap doors. So lastly, we have the item frame, which goes right here, and the glass pane. And there's our headlight. And there you guys have it, folks. You have successfully completed the E100 German World War II prototype heavy tank, or super heavy tank program, I believe. Same as the mouse. So thank you guys for watching. If you guys like this, pro if you guys like this uh, episode, please hit that like button wherever they're going to go to. Hit that subscribe button as well. Yeah, I would love a new edition of my Blender Valve wonderful subscribers. Thank you guys so, so much for doing what you do. Liking, subscribing, and sharing, and all that really means a lot to me. Means a lot to you. Know, means a lot to community. Speaking of community, don't forget to join the Discord server. Link is down in the description for you so you can come chat, join, hang out, uh, post pictures, post memes, post your builds, post your YouTube channels, uh, promote yourself. I don't really care as long as it's appropriate. So... If yeah, you like that, remember to like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye! <laughs>